I'm uh, Christian Krogstad. I like flair bartending, it's awesome. Here, doing a flare competition for the Aviation Gym in uh, House Spirits. It has been eight years since I actually really tried to do something by throwing a bottle in the air. We have to make one fancy cocktail. As many ingredients as I can put in there, I think that's the key. And when I serve it to Jeff Morgenthaler, he'll be really excited about it. I can do that, check. I can do that, yeah, check. Yeah, yeah, definitely not. Um, like kamikazes? Red-headed sluts, I love red-headed sluts. I'm about to judge the uh, flare bartending competition. I'm a judge tonight, and they call me the hanging judge. I have no favorites in any way, shape, or form, though I am totally available for bribing. That's a hacky sack with alcohol. Flare, uh, to set things on fire. Mostly it's just a thumb roll, it's just a Like, what's the move? Um, <laughs> there's juggling and there's bartending and the twain shall near meet, but I'm also aware that, you know, I've seen enough flair that I realize that we all kind of flair a little bit. It tends to be young, single, uh, male. This tends to be the characteristics of it. You don't find a lot of old flair bartenders because they discover things like a life uh, and, you know, a wife, child, things like that. Woo! There's one guy named Stacy Ruff who I think is probably going to be the guy that's going to step up and kind of wow people. And I won it last year, but anyway. I'm kind of scared to death because I know they've been practicing. I haven't had a chance to practice at all. I'm just going to go out there and I'm going to get myself real riled up because I just went through a, uh, a breakup of sorts. I'm going to go out there on stage and I'm just going to express it. I'm taking them all down. <laughs> Everyone had a good time. Claire's back.